everybody, Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89. It's today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for me and Robico Chapter 23. And Robico and her knees are considered a new hero. Uh, well, at least a jump festa. And this makes me really, really happy because from the very first chapter, I have loved this manga. Even when when people up here in the West were hating. I'm me and Robico. I stuck by it because I love Misa Niche series. So I'm very, very glad that more people, um, especially in the West, are loving it. And I'm glad the Japanese readers are loving it. I knew they were going to like it because of all the parodies uh, that we're getting. So oh, I'm very, very, very happy with this shit. But anyway, last chapter really made my life because we we got a Twitter chapter. And you guys know I uh, know. I'm addicted to Twitter. <laughs> I have a horrible Twitter addiction. Um, and the fact that we saw Lady Gaga and Justin Bieber up in this bitch was freaking hilarious too. Uh, but anyway, um, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. The lady I, finally, I fondly call mom is not my mom. The boy I live with is not my sibling. This is the Tyra home and normal household. Rubico and I'm an order maid. Coming or or so I thought. Oh my god, are we gonna get we gonna find out what the fuck Robico is this week? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this chapter is on the promised neverland of Robico. Yes! Yes! Oh my god, I know why you're doing this, Miyazaki. I and I didn't realize that Miyazaki wrote um the promised neverland uh parody until recently so <laughs> oh man this is great um oh my god i have to read this summary of of the promised neverland because this is this is gonna be good emma once lived happily at um at Gracefield House, an orphanage, the other boys and girls were like brothers and sisters to her, and she called the mistress of the orphanage mom, but that was before Emma discovered the shocking truth. She and the other orphans were actually being raised as food, to, uh, food to be eaten by hideous demons. The orphanage is a cage. Her mother is an enemy, and if the children want to be, stay alive, they must escape. That should that should catch you up, since this week's chapter of Me and Robico was written assuming no, um, assuming knowledge of the promised ever lamp but you're already uh you're all already reading it right <laughs> um and to answer your question miyazaki i covered the promised neverland on my channel from chapter three from chapter three to the very end and even the extra chapters damn straight i covered the i read slash covered the promised neverland i even have a playlist for proof I tried watching the anime adaptation and, oh, season one, the first couple, after like two episodes, I was just like, nope, nope, couldn't watch it because Cloverworks wanted to focus on the horror and get rid of the best part of uh, um, Promised Neverland, the psychological horror aspects, but that's a whole different thing. The Promised Neverland movie was so good. It was totally different from the parody manga, right? Right, but that version is great too. Yeah, it's a it's a um, really cinematic story. I bet it'd also make a good anime. What an awkward attempt to ask for an anime adaptation! Yes, Miyazaki, I love you. Oh my god, you are, dude. Th this manga, I swear, is my spirit animal. How <laughs> where have you been all my life, Miyazaki? This manga is life. Let's go hit up Domio's Pizza and discuss it. Yeah, I'll, it'll double as an anime season two hype party. Let's go. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I am not looking forward to... Uh, dude, I'm not even going to watch season two. Unless I... Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, God. I can't... I uh, just... After what Cloverworks did with season one, I, I'm not even going to. I stopped watching manga to anime adaptations like a year ago. Over a year ago now. I can't. I can't with this shit. I'm gonna make a video on um, Jump Festa stuff, but oh gosh, Yasaki, uh, you reminded me, reminded me. Ah, uh, Master, I'm sorry. I said I would help your mother today, so I'm going to head home. Oh, you did? Okay. Did Robocop seem off to you? 
Huh? You think so, Ook? Maybe she said she can't hang out? A warm bed, delicious food, an order made uniform, and an ID number on my underwear? <laughs> it's too much to be a coincidence. Um, the protagonist is a charming, energetic girl just like me. We're similar in so many ways. Uh-uh, Robico, there's a difference between you and Emma, though. Unlike you, Emma's a complete Mary Sue. And I know that rhyme. I'm, <laughs> I know. But Emma is a complete Mary Sue. If you have not realized this by now, then I don't know what the fuck is wrong with you. And I covered it in my Promised Neverland Live reaction videos. Emma is a complete Mary Sue. And I could and I can't stand that they did that to her. Emma had so much potential, but fuck. Ugh. Uh, could this mean? I've been raised to be- <laughs> I've been raised to be eaten! <laughs> no, no, what? No way! If I were, I would've been shipped out long ago. <laughs> my knees? <laughs> if they're waiting for my knees to fully develop, everything makes sense! Um, in that gorgeous- ne Oh my god! The art from- Promise Neverland, it, Posica, that art is just, mm, that art is gorgeous shit. If you have seen, like, especially the cover for um, the next volume of the Promise Neverland, oh my god, that art is just gorgeous. Especially, and eat, fuck, even the cover pages for the, um, for the extra chapters, oh my god, oh my god, it was just fucking art. That was pure art. I'm sorry, I had to... Mizaki, you making me geek out. You know what? Ah, sorry, plushies, that you're falling. You got me no choice here. I gotta use my, I gotta use, I got my Promise Neverland plushie right here. I gotta use my Norman plushie for this. In that gorgeous Neverland art book, uh, Shirai Sensei talked, um, yeah. Shirai Sensei talked uh, about how much they love the girl's legs that uh, Demizu Sensei draws, so given that there's no other explanation, I'm going to be eating. Wait, is this really true? I have not seen the art book, but is that really true? I need to know this. Uh, a must-have for all. Dude, I need to have. First of all, I need to have this book. I fucking hate that I'm broke, so I can't afford it. But for those of you that have this book, I want to know if that's true. Curse these knees. Why do they have to get full marks? Robico? Mom, I know you said you wanted to help, but there's not much I need you to do right now. Feel free to hang out with Bajo. Is she an enemy? Is she just checking out in on her livestock? Well, when you're carrying that knife, yeah, I, I kind of think so. Um, it's okay. I'd feel terrible if I ended up freeloading. Now, Robico, you know I really do think of you as my own daughter, so try not to be too self-conscious about your place here. And goodness, please don't say such sad things. Mom... Robico, you dummy! Mom would never do something as awful as shipping you out. Get a grip, silly. Um, Tyra Residence. Woo. Um, hi, this is Gaku Sirizawa. Oh, not um, not at all. So my family runs an orange farm in uh, Yamaguchi Prefecture, and I was thinking Bondo and the kids might like some of our orange um oranges. Oh my, a farm? A farm? Oh God. Um, it's just about to, um, it's just about time to ship them out. I'll send some extra high grade ones. Goodness, you're shipping the extra high grade ones? Thank you so much. Shipping out extra high grade? Yeah, Norman, that, that includes you too. If I, uh, if I send them today, they should arrive tomorrow. Look forward to them. Under, <laughs> understood. Goodbye. I'm being shipped out. I knew it. I've been livestock all along. Mr. Sirizawa says he's going to ship us some oranges. Do you like oranges, Robico? Uh, well, well, I guess you wanted to go play after all. The the foot and meanwhile on the foothills. That was a close one. If I'd stayed um, at home, she would have realized I was broken. Um, I was onto her and broken my leg. Do you guys give up? Uh, I give up. Sorry, do you give up? I give up. But this glitches it. Mom serves the demons. Do what you're good. She's carrying around that knife. Like, and also the shit that we saw a couple weeks ago. Yeah. And also Miyazaki. Top notch stuff. But what do you expect? He's the artist. Uh, he, he's the manga behind the Promise Neverland parody. 
I want to escape right now, but the problem is, which side is Master on? I'll hide for now and see how. Hey! Um, there you are, Robico. Master! Nobody was supposed to know where to find me. How, how did you? You're transmitter, obviously. Tra <laughs> Neverland um, movie that's out in Japan. Um, I'm curious if you guys have seen the movie, uh, and and yes, this is the live action uh, adaptation. I want to know if you if it's good because with live action uh, manga to live action adaptations, um, they're hit or miss uh, because some of them are really really bad, um, like Attack on Titan. And then there's some that, that are just really, really good, like Kingdom and Gintama and uh, Tokyo Ghoul and Bleach um, and Roroni Kenshin, just to name a few. So I'm very curious um, 
if you've seen the promise neverland uh uh live action if it's good or not and um and what'd you guys think of this chapter this chapter Yuzaki, like it gave me life it did especially the, that that like dude that was a roast with the anime let's be real it really was a dig at it um well actually maybe not it was totally different from the parody manga but um but when awkward attempt to ask for an anime adaptation yeah yeah i know uh, yeah it's not a dig at it but for me it's a like i can't i'm ugh. you know what i kind of think it is a dig at the anime adaptation because <laughs> you know what this tells me is that based on this writing that the live action is good but the anime adaptation is bad that uh, season one is bad that's what i'm getting from this really curious what you guys think i love love the art that uh we got from miyazaki on this um i'm very curious if the art book stuff is true or if that was just a joke i let me know in the comments section um about that um but and i want to know what you guys think um let me know uh, your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Roboco content, there's a few ways you could do that. You can donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, friend me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.